being natural is very <laughs> difficult but worth it and I'm gonna explain why with my pros and cons of being natural <laughs> so for me my natural hair story is pretty simple and blunt like I've never got a perm never got a uh, relaxer and I thank God that I did it because I see the memes of y'all scalp burning and all that stuff mm. no. so <laughs> my natural hair story is pretty blunt um, the only thing that I think is pretty different is that I straightened my hair a lot in middle school um, and the beginning of high school I always used to straighten you know trying to get my hair to be straight like the white girls and everything and I think that was one of my problems and it broke a lot of my hair, a lot of my hair. Um, over time, I grew out of it, and I'm at this now. <laughs> my little afro puff. And yeah. <laughs> One pro about being natural is that you can get your hair wet at any point. <laughs> any point. You don't have to worry about running inside when it's raining, making sure you cover your leave out. And you can exercise the way you want because you don't have to worry about sweating out your perm. You don't have to worry about sweating out your edges and everything like that because now you have a free head of hair that doesn't really care if it needs to be sweated out. <laughs> You can jump in the pool, you can jump in the water at the beach, you can go in the springs, you can wet your hair because you don't have to worry about your leave out freezing out, you don't have to worry about your tracks getting messed up, like, the sky's the limit, like, I say that a lot, but yeah, it's like, when you don't have all that stuff, like, your natural hair can soak up that water. A con about being natural is that it is, it is time consuming. <laughs> and what I mean by it being time consuming is that it takes forever for you to figure out what hairstyle that you want to do. And it takes forever for that hairstyle to actually be in place. It may not be very hard for you, but for me, it is so hard slicking down my hair and trying to get it into a bun. And when I'm trying to do my bantu knots at night, it takes forever. And doing like little twist outs, it takes forever. So yes, it is very time consuming. <laughs> Pro is that is really funny your arm muscles like your little biceps are getting stronger because the time that you take to do your hair and you keep your arms up like this and trying to do all of that extra stuff your arms are getting stronger you get little biceps <laughs> So that wasn't my real reason. But being natural is way healthier, and that's my pro. Reason being is perms and relaxers contain ingredients that you use to take out clogs in your sinks, your toilets, and your shower drains. And just imagine go that going into your pores and your scalp, it's not, it's not the move. And it burns your scalp so much. And some of you guys are just like, oh, I just have a little burn in my scalp. But it can affect your your health. And it's also been proven that when you have natural hair, your hair grows more. It sheds less. It has more nutrients in it. And it becomes thicker. And it grows more. People may think that, oh, if I have a perm, my hair touches down here. Yes, it's long. But little do they know is that once you get a perm, it's burning your scalp and it's burning the follicles and the pores that you do have in your scalp and it stunts the growth that you want. It stunts the growth. So yes, being natural is healthier because your hair is slowly dying when you do have perm and relaxers. A con about being natural is the transitioning stage. What I said before, I've never went through the transitioning phase, but I have friends that have. And 
you either have to do the big chop or you have to see your hair breaking off and you have like curly hair like this and then at the ends you have like little straight hairs it's it's hard but the end result is worth it but transitioning is not fun another pro is that your hair is very versatile when you're natural <laughs> what I mean by that is is that a lot of people mistakenly think that when you're natural you only have one hairstyle no once your hair reaches up to like three to two inches there the sky's the limit you can do braids you can do twist outs you can do you can just straighten it if you want you can do bantu knots you can do braid back cornrows whatever your heart desires your the sky is the limit your hair can do whatever it wants to that's what a lot of people forget that when you're natural your hair can do anything <laughs> A con about being natural is the trial and error, the experimenting. <laughs> there are so many natural hair care products in the world that you're going to have to try and see if it works for your hair and if your hair likes it. And if it doesn't, it's just like, eh, I just wasted my money. And if it does, it's like, eh, I can keep it or I can try something else and see if it works better. It's not fun. And it took me a long time to finally find the hair product that works for me. And my hair product that works for me may not work for you. And it may not work for the person next to me. But it's all in trial and error. And it is costly. So, yeah. Combing out your hair. <laughs> Brushing your hair. When your natural is a con, your head will be on fire. <laughs> so make sure when you do do all of that, make sure your hair is wet or you have a detangler so you're not pulling out every strand of your hair. It's such a con because God knows I hate combing my hair. I hate detangling because it's not, it's not easy. <laughs> and my final pro is that it's all yours. It's all yours. Don't get me wrong. I love, I love me some weave. But once I have my natural hair out and once I'm rocking my curls, it's a whole new level of confidence that's on me. Cause it's so funny when people be like, Oh my gosh, did you buy that puff from the um from the from the hair store? And I'll be like, No girl, <laughs> this is all me. <laughs> but it's it's a whole nother level of confidence that I have for myself when I have my hair and I'm rocking my curls. So yes, I say being natural brings a confidence that you never had before. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay.